Welcome to Julie the Thrifty Designer. This is my formal living room tour for my Thanksgiving collection this year. And those years ago, don't remember, could have been like the Dollar Tree, but I don't remember. Had them for a long time though. And I got the berries at a thrift store. And the corn I've had for years and I don't remember where I got them from. And it says, with God all things are possible. Got that? I do believe Walmart. And that was a new find for this year. Candles that are a standby. Dollar Tree. And I just bought the... Uh, they're already sticky little rhinestone things and I just cut them into the shape I needed and then got these from Hobby Lobby's. Oh no, Michael's, sorry. And just glued them on. Made them very pretty. Just tuck in fall leaves and a pumpkin. And then my new find at the thrift store the other day. Seven dollars and it's a real feather turkey. He is so cool. I just liked him. Couldn't pass him up. And then a candle holder with a turkey on it. And then another dollar store candle. Happy Thanksgiving. Again, it's just a card stuck in a Dollar Tree frame. That's a real pumpkin. A friend of mine gave me that. A beautiful little pheasant. Found those at the thrift store, but they're really old. Isn't that pretty? And I have all this hooked up to a simple, turns out all the lights, or turn them on. You don't have to use them just for your tree. Well, stompers are wonderful for just different areas where you can't reach to plug everything in. And then my sofa. The pillows came from Walmart in their clearance. Uh, well, I don't know if it was clearance, but it was in their, uh, their garden center where they have them for your patio and stuff. And I just thought, okay, got to have them. They bring in a lot of nice colors. They were five dollars each and then here's another one of those trays that are, you know I find these at the dollar store I mean at the thrift store and then I bought the glass globes at the dollar and up store and I put in the Dollar Tree candles this looks so neat I just love how they sparkle and glow and this turkey is technically a candle, and it's even had a spot where I see a light or something at one point melted onto it. <laughs> had those forever. I see this is not where it normally was supposed to be. There we go. Just a pretty little setting. I haven't had a chance to replace the lights that burned out. They just burned out yesterday, of course just in time for Thanksgiving. So now I gotta dig around and get out my lights and replace them. But there's old Tom Turkey. I've had him forever. Hope this shows. Looks like it's okay. And then another little turkeys and picks and pumpkins and another little turkey. And I guarantee you I got them on clearance or uh, at the thrift stores. Possibly dollar store. And up here just simple. All I did was put some pumpkins, a gourd, and some leaves. 
And uh, my mother was in the nursing home with Alzheimer's for quite a long time. And the nursing home had her do some crafts. And my mom painted that when she was in the nursing home, probably the year before she died, or the Thanksgiving before she died. So that's pretty uh, important to me. Here's a picture of my mom when she was 25 years old. And the glass got broke, but I've had that picture for a long time. And then up here, just the simple gourd and picks and pumpkins and things that I'd found from, I think those were Dollar Tree a few years back. Sorry, I can't tell you if you can get them now or not. I doubt it. <laughs> and then up on top, I have one more turkey just sitting on a perch up there. And then just a simple little arrangement. And then on my table before the between the chairs here, I just have a simple. I've had these guys for a long, long time. Well, actually, the turkey I've had for a long, long time. Those guys actually were at the dollar store, and they were, they are salt and pepper shakers. But I think they're just cute as just little statues. Again, another white little pumpkin, and another things I found at the thrift store through the years, and a candle. <laughs> and then just to be silly and have a little touch of whimsy. It's truly a hat. I know the lighting is bad in here. There we go. <laughs> you put it on your head. It's a turkey hat. It's just funny. You know, he's just meant to be silly and humorous. <laughs> so, this is my Thanksgiving. Oh, I have one more section to show you. And of course, also, I put lights on this and they burned out. I can't win. It seems like one thing or another, but I just found this beautiful arrangement that I have spruced up and put all, well, no, it's, I didn't find it. I mean, I made this. I, it's all picks that I have picked up on clearance, and I just stuck them all in there, just arranged it into a vase that I picked up from the thrift store. And just made it a really pretty shape. And then I have another turkey. I have my scent pot back there, which is one I got from Walmart. So it makes the house smell so good. And then again, just some fall leaves and picks and your harvest field with your pumpkins and grapes and whatever's there. It's just pretty. And then down below, I just have some simple pumpkins. It's nothing elaborate, nothing hard, just I threw everything together. And so, this is my formal living room this year. I hope it has inspired all of you to really enjoy your Thanksgiving and decorate for it. Enjoy it. And then, of course, you've seen on my other video, my dining room. And if you haven't seen it, look for it. I'm showing this one. So, I want to wish all of you a happy Thanksgiving. May the Lord bless all of you. And remember to count your many blessings. Name them one by one. So, from my house to yours, happy Happy Thanksgiving.